Well, the start of school is less than a week away now for many districts, and parents are putting plans in place to ensure their kids get the best education during this unusual school year. 41 Action News reporter Nick Starling explains why these pandemic pots are becoming more popular. This idea came about as a way to help guide students through virtual learning. It's essentially a small group of students learning in person with a hired teacher. It's quickly becoming in demand with many parents. Seven-year-old Evie B. McLean is about to enter seven. second grade virtually. It's like an iPad thing, so it's kind of fun. But she won't be alone thanks to her parents finding a Facebook page. Little Evie is joining a pandemic pod to learn, which is a relief for her parents. I'm actually kind of excited about the school year a little bit now just because um, I know what's going to be the environment for my daughter. The pod provides a controlled environment to learn with a teacher to help them. It means that I have somebody on my side to really help me out. With a dedicated instructor who's going to be helping her if she doesn't know, if she's not grasping some of the concepts that um, are coming through through the virtual um, instruction. Um, I think that that is a huge part of it. It's a trend that caught parent yeah. Ashley Hunt's eye. Uh, that's my main goal is to make sure my kids are making friends. She has two kids, one going into kindergarten and the other first grade, but she knows not every kid is as fortunate. I know that there's families out there that are like struggling with that kids can't be in school um, and that's it's just not fair and I don't know the answer. She's hoping there's opportunities out there for more students to take on this way of learning as it can be expensive. I think a step is people that are able to to be having those conversations about what can we do and uh, a step is putting your money where your mouth is and trying to put in place programs that can can help other kids that maybe can't, that don't have parents that can do this. Reporting in Prairie Village, Nick Starling, 41 Action News.